Hey, this is Kapil Dev Sharma and right now I'm in Yeonlong, Seoul, South Korea. This is a country, South Korea, since independence is supposed to be very poor, but these people have worked so hard to make it a very developed country. Right now, Korea is one of the developed countries in the world. When I came here some seven days ago, I found many things I'd like to share with all of you. That uh, One thing is the cleanliness, these people, because in any country, the president or the prime minister just only force people to do so, but it's the responsibility of the citizens to make their country clean. Because uh, as you can see, the green present out here is fantastic. It's been an amazing experience so far for the seven days, but you know, some of the things that I've noticed that people here are well mannered, they are helpful, they are hard working, they work pretty hard to make their country clean, to make the country developed and uh, so far it's been a giant in terms of technology. Uh, as I'm a lover of cars, uh, yesterday I went to Auto Gallery in which I found my personal favorite Lamborghini, Ancesto Elemento and uh, Bentley, Continental, Jaguar, Land Rover, Porsche and other stuff out there. You know one thing? When people buy these beats, they do not blow horn in the city. I would like to repeat this once again. When people buy these beats, even a person is sitting on a Mercedes Benz, he will not blow horn to you. Even you are crossing the crosswalk. I repeat, that's the pretty interesting thing I found here. People do not blow horns here because they find that if someone blows horn, it's he's abusing or he's saying some, other, some abusive words at that point of time because he is angry at the point of time. So. They have peace, they have patience, they prefer the others to go ahead because if you are crossing a crosswalk then uh, the car in front of you will stop and it will let you, let you go. That's pretty awesome. And one more thing I'd like to mention here that people do not buy bikes because that's a cold country and uh, there's a problem of wind here. If you go on a bike, you'll find wind. So, key, so to keep themselves free from the wind, they generally buy cars. Also, they are fitness freak. So they generally prefer to go on a public transport or their cycles. They have cycles and here they prefer to go 14 to 15 kilometers per day on a cycle according to the availability. So these people, if you say a person of 58, you can define his or she's 50 because they are fit, pretty fit in terms of their fitness. Several parks have this availability to keep people fit and they enjoy their fitness here. The lifestyle of people is pretty easy here. It is considered to be one of the safest countries of the world. If you come home at 12 a.m. night, you'll be safe. They do not interrupt in the fitness of others. So they keep themselves as well as the others safe. People have great life and work balance here. They work pretty hard on those five days and they enjoy themselves at the weekend. They find themselves pretty fit because you can see there are different different gardens, parks and availabilities here. There are theme parks, amusement parks and they enjoy a lot here. And when they come here, they find themselves pretty fit. So these are the few terms I've explained in this video. There are many more. I can't explain just one video. I've uploaded separate videos for each of the terms of the places I've visited here. It's been seven days here and I'm loving the experience. Looking forward to visiting this country once again and throughout the world. So it's great Korea. See you once again in the next video. Thank you. This is Kapadev Firma. Uh, thanks for joining me.
कोई नहीं कोई अपने ऊपर है जो यूज करना है चलो मैं सोच रहा हूँ ये बोल दूंगा जो मन में आ रहा है